What's good YouTube? In this video, we'll be going over how to install WhatsApp on your BlackBerry Classic on BlackBerry 10 in 2022. If you find this kind of content helpful, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching. So the BlackBerry Classic is really shaping up to be a very resilient device as there's been a lot of developments in regards to BlackBerry that would make you think that this device shouldn't be around any longer. It's been out for over five years and it still has quite a loyal fan following. BlackBerry has killed support for the BlackBerry Classic as well as other BlackBerry 10 devices. BlackBerry 10, of course, is the operating system that is run on the BlackBerry Classic. But despite this, there's still a very loyal user base of BlackBerry Classic users on the internet. And what this user base has found out is that a lot of the basic phone functions of the BlackBerry Classic are still working. As after January 4th, 2022, BlackBerry formally announced that they'll be ending support for all BlackBerry 10 devices. And many users received text messages and messages from their service providers that their BlackBerry Classic wouldn't be functioning. But surprise, surprise, a lot of reports are coming in that the BlackBerry Classic, including my own, are still perfectly functional as smartphones after the end of life period. And of course, one of the essential features of the smartphone is to be able to send messages. And I'm happy to report that WhatsApp is still functioning on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. WhatsApp, of course, will replace all of the main features that you have for BlackBerry messaging. And you can still use text messaging on the BlackBerry Classic, by the way, but a lot of people do prefer WhatsApp. So let's go over the steps in installing WhatsApp on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. The first step that you'll need is to have a working version of Google Play services running on your BlackBerry Classic. If you don't already have this, what you want to do is check out the link in the description below for a step-by-step -step guide on how to install Google Play services on a BlackBerry 10 device. It's a bit of a tricky thing and it might require multiple restarts, much like some of the other steps in this video, but it does work and WhatsApp and Google Play services is working on my classic in 2022. Step two in installing WhatsApp on the BlackBerry Classic is downloading the WhatsApp APK. So usually when you want to install WhatsApp, you would go through a platform like the Play Store or Apple's App Store to download the necessary files for WhatsApp. But because we're running a fairly old operating system, it might be harder to get WhatsApp on the Google Play Store. It's possible, but it's, it's actually quite tricky. So what you want to do in terms of downloading the APK for WhatsApp is to go directly to WhatsApp itself. So what you want to do is fire up a browser or the internet browser for the BlackBerry Classic and the address that you want to go to is www.whatsapp.com slash android and here you'll have a prompt to download the latest version of WhatsApp Messenger. The version that I'm seeing is 2.22.3.70. So once you start to download on WhatsApp you'll get prompted to save it to your files. You want to do so and you want to wait for the download to finish. I'm just going to let the download finish here so you can see a step-by-step -step guide on how to download WhatsApp and install it on the BlackBerry Classic.
The next step in installing WhatsApp on your BlackBerry Classic is to actually install the downloaded APK file. Some warning on this step is that this may crash once or twice, and you actually might get a prompt that Google Play is not detected or functioning on your app. What you want to do is keep hitting OK as the installation should go through, provided you have a running version of Google Play services on your BlackBerry Classic. It might take a bit longer than a normal APK file, and it might be at this processing stage for a few minutes here, but if you let it run, it should be able to get installed on the BlackBerry Classic. So after a few restarts, if necessary, you'll find that WhatsApp is actually loaded onto one of your home screens. Go to the home screen and you want to boot up WhatsApp. The first boot takes a little bit longer, but you'll see that eventually, maybe potentially after a few restarts, that voila, you have WhatsApp functioning on the BlackBerry Classic. So there you have it everyone, a very useful app that can still work on the BlackBerry Classic in 2022. I was quite surprised that I was able to do this after BlackBerry formally ended support for the BlackBerry Classic, but nonetheless, we still have a perfectly functioning smartphone with a physical keyboard running a very old operating system on the BlackBerry Classic. So if you found this video helpful or if you have any other messaging apps that are still working on your BlackBerry Classic, Classic, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.